Hi everybody, it's Diane. I'm here with a new project today. I have a lot of things I could be doing or should be doing, but I had a few Rudolph Valentino things shoved over for a someday project and I thought, okay, get rid of them, do something. So I think I'm going to make a Rudolph zine. That Hello Kitty one was fun and they do take time because you're decorating a lot of things, but that's what I'm doing. So anyway, I printed off a couple pictures just from the internet. That, yeah. Okay, there, I'm done. I'm just going to put that on there. I'm going to tear the side. And I really don't have any real plans. Just collage stuff. This, I need to get... Uh, I didn't realize, I just pulled this out in a, I think it was that harvesting video. It's an old painting drawing. It doesn't say what it is. 1917. I didn't realize that was that old. But anyway, I need to find a picture of Rudolph in his matador costume. But I didn't do that yet. That's pretty cool. Um, I was thinking, too, the front cover... Do I want to just write Valentino magazine letters? Yeah, tell me that's not appropriate. Yeah, I'll do that and do something on that side more. Well, let's see what we can find. Great place to start. I should save that for a beginning of a journal or something, shouldn't I? Might be hard to find a V, right? There's a four. I was it's a little small though. This picture is from the uh, Four Horsemen of the Apocalypse. So I'm thinking I should put a four on there, but it's a little small. I just read a quote. I mean, who knows if it's right, but um, Rudolph was talking to somebody before that movie came about, but it had been brought to his attention. He said, it's called the Four Horsemen of something I can't pronounce. <laughs> I thought that was funny. Well, okay. I don't know if this is going to do anything. This is that jewelry type magazine I decided to save. That could be neat. I don't really want to get rid of that. Okay. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Well. What about that? I read too, Rudolph was one of the first men to wear a wrist watch as opposed to you know, a pocket watch. And I uh, was kind of criticized for it at the time. Well, yeah, now I don't know. I don't want to play up the goal. And I probably don't need to tell you, this is going to take more than one video to get through this. Oh, it's a dragon. No, it's a big glare, Diane. 
Uh, hmm. I was going to say, I thought for a minute it was a snake. He was in a movie called Cobra, but it's not. So just forget it. Just forget it. And actually, I really like that movie. That one did not do so well at the time, but I like that one a lot. Legend. Hmm, maybe we need that somewhere. This paper is pretty nice. It has a nice weight to it. Maybe we could just use this and we don't even have to use any other one, right? I keep thinking I should save that too, just for, you know obvious reason. Oh, there it is, up close. And now I'm not going to save it for my Dragon Blue Book page. Oh, this though. <laughs> is that glaring? Okay. Maybe, maybe? I don't know. Oh, that's cool too. Oh, shoot. Now we have way too many choices. Okay, back to Mr. Valentino. There's a V. Not too exciting though, is it? Well, No, it's not too exciting. You're right, Diane, it's not. Well, all right, let's see what we have here. I think Legend will save for something else. I mean, for him, but another page. Did you get that? I'm tired today. Just, <laughs> you can probably tell by my conversation. I probably don't even have to say it, do I? My dogs are outside with my husband, so you may hear barking or something. And actually, I'm going to have to pause in a few minutes. All right, I'm not going to cut out the other side of that, but my printer's making noise and I have a dog scratching to come in. <laughs> <laughs> it's a potpourri. This one, maybe I will not fussy cut. I kind of like that. It's a little... Of course, it looks very masculine, though, doesn't it? I was going to say, it's a little dull, but maybe for a guy, that would be something. Oh, that's pretty, isn't it, that tile? I'm sure those aren't plastic, and if you don't know what I'm talking about, you have to go read a previous video. Read a pre... <laughs> well, you could read it. Read a previous video of mine, or view it. I talk about tile in my house. Super. Get super style. Okay. Oh, my dog. All right. I'll pause. I'll piece this stuff in a little better, and then we'll pick it up. Okay. I have returned. In case you were curious, I didn't want to, you know, not give you information. That bracelet's only $9,000. Okay. This may not make it. I don't know. 
I found some letters and this is where we are. I need something under there. Kind of negative. I don't know if I really like. This is the uh, back of a sofa. <laughs> but I kind of like the color. Yeah, I like the color. I don't know. So anyway, I was going to flip through a few more magazines. See if we can't fill that in. See if there's any other letters we have to have. And I have to glare at you folks more. There's a V. Well. This sort of looks like a cobra, doesn't it? I think so. Hmm. I'm not really, as far as what I'm constructing here, trying to, you know, tell his story or his life or anything. I'm just making pictures of interest, I think, with him, in case you're curious. You could do that. That would be kind of cool. What do I need? An A and L, an I. How about these? This might be nice, the color here. Actually, I thought this ad was kind of neat. She's got the Tiffany blue there on her eyes. Clever. Maybe we could do something creative. <laughs> How about it, Diane? Yeah, I'm still thinking about Bizarro, and I had an idea. Uh, well, I'm not going to another idea for a zine and stuff, and I've got to make valen uh, Valentine cards. <laughs> I think I have Valentino on my mind. I have to make. Halloween cards. I've got stuff I should be putting in my journal. There's another V there. Yeah, that's better. Oh, I need an L. And I still need to fill that in. Well, how boring would gray be to kind of mimic that? It's okay. Actually, that's kind of sophisticated looking. There's a word I don't use too much. <laughs> but why, Diane? No comment. What did I say? An L? And that, is that it? I don't know. I can't spell when they're not apart. need. I need a, I have an old orange crate, literally. That was my grandfather's. That um, I had LPs in, and then just to make a long story short, I did a little re rearranging, and I have them in a different, it's an old TV stand. And I took the bottom shelves out, and they fit in there really well. But I hate this stupid stand. I don't like it. So <laughs> I may go back to the orange crate. I don't know. Isn't that interesting? You know what I'm saying? You've got Rudolph Valentino staring you in the face, and you're talking about orange crates and LPs, and you hate your TV stand. Yeah. Maybe that's why he's giving me that look. Well, all right. I don't see an L. Okay, well... That was for the cover anyway. How can we duplicate this so it looks cool and artsy and stuff? I don't know. I don't 
don't know, Rudolph. What do you think? That just looks confusing. I don't know. All right, I'm going to pause and glue I th the background stuff. These I'll leave off because I don't know. I'm thinking of leaving the white. I kind of like that. If I decide I don't, I, I'll cover it over with paint probably. Okay. Oh, there's an L. Might be too big. It's awfully boring too. Okay, I'll be back. Okay. The words are not glued. Everything else is. It's obviously not trimmed. I'm going back to this jewelry magazine catalog, whatever it is, because um, this was cut crooked. I don't know who did that, but anyway, it was very crooked. I just couldn't, it just did not want to straighten up. It was being a problem, so I tore it. So it's a little short. So I don't know if I want something there. I kind of think I want something on this side. I don't know what not that. I cut those apart because it just wouldn't really fit with two big square things and that was cut really tight. I couldn't rip it. I, I didn't like the fact that one was torn and one was cut. Things like that. I'm also questioning these letters. I, I was just thinking, you know, I don't know, maybe that's not the right uh, shade to go with black. So I'm not sure I want those letters. Is it glaring a little bit? Which means I need more letters in case that wasn't clear. Watch, would a watch face do anything on that side? Like half a watch? Not if you drop it, Diane. You'll never know. And yes, our heat finally broke not too bad today. Well, it's kind of cool. And if you were smart, would you put the other half on the other side? No, because I don't think it's going to fit, but let's try it. save it. Maybe it can go on another page. Oh, and it's got a matching uh, bracelet that's got diamonds in it. That's only uh, $29,000. Wow, what a bargain. All right, sorry about that, folks. It was a dog interruption. the mailman if you want to know why we had to bark I'm sorry it was the mail carrier I once read and it makes sense why dogs bark at mail carriers because they're usually wearing a hat the dog barks at them and they leave you know because they're just dropping mail and they leave but the dog thinks they're scaring them away so it's you know that's why they do it. Okay. We don't have to do it every day, do we? I think some of us think so, right? Yeah, because now we're just laying down. Our work is done.
and I'm fussy cutting and not talking. Probably all for naught anyway. Oh, that's not too bad. Looks very kind of expecting. Okay, actually, I kind of like that. I think we'll get rid of this last one. All right. <laughs> I don't know if you could hear that. Could you hear kind of a putt splat sound? I could give you a guess. I don't think you'd ever guess what it is. It's walnuts falling out of... Technically, I think it's my tree, but it's on the property line between me and our neighbors. And this time of year, it drops walnuts. Do yourself a favor. Never plant a walnut tree or buy one. Buy a house that has walnut trees. Just, just don't. Some good letters. Uh, that might be too big. I think we're getting too big. I think we need something up here. Let's think about that instead of walnuts. Some ears are worse than others, too. I hit a tree guy once told me it does depend on the weather. They like, Walnut trees like hot weather, which <laughs> that's what we had, isn't it? Yeah, I have a feeling a long time ago somebody that owned this house thought walnut trees supposedly black walnut wood is really good but the trees have to be pretty darn big before you can really harvest it and I think somebody had a brainy idea that they were gonna make money and plant walnut trees <laughs> so the only money being made are the tree guys taking them down I like that over there And nobody on YouTube today, except Diane, is griping about walnut trees, right? Sorry. <laughs> well, I don't know. It kind of it's starting to look like you know, there's little things in the corner. Maybe down there. All right, that's not too bad. Tell me though, what about this uh, second set of Italian Sense of Beauty? I, should we just trash it? I thought it was kind of cool. Well, why don't we all think about that? I'm gonna pause and clue, and we'll see what I decided when I come back. Okay, I think I'm done. I made the words kind of look like they're under this chain, link, whatever it is. I think it's fine. I like it. I think for now I'm just going to leave it. I was thinking a little paint. I could splotch some paint. Okay, I'll do that real quick. I'm not even going to use a brush. And then I think we'll call this a video and we'll come back. I'll, I'll find letters and maybe next time we'll come back and work on the cover. It's not cooperating. Okay. All right. Okay. Start on our Rudy zine. Pretty neat. See you next time. Have a nice day out there.